why 2 to the power 3, or 2 cubed, isn't 6. You might sometimes come across an expression where a big 2 has a little 3 raised up next to it. This can be read as 2 to the power 3, or 2 cubed. But what does it mean, and what does it equal? Well, 2 cubed does not equal 2 times 3. It's not the same thing. To work out what it does mean is simple. You simply take the first number and write it down the second number of times, leaving a space between each digit. You then fill in the gaps with the multiplication sign. This is now easy to work out. 2 times 2 equals 4, and 4 times 2 equals 8. So 2 to the power 3, or 2 cubed, equals 8. Why do some people call 2 to the power 3 2 cubed? Again, this is easy because we can think of the question as a problem in geometry. The single number 2 can make a line of length 2 units. This is a one dimensional measurement. What if I measure in two dimensions? I get a square with two units on each side. The total number of unit squares is 2 times 2 equals 4. This is the same as 2 to the power 2 or 2 squared. It's the number of little squares you can count when you make a big square with two little squares on each side. See why it's called squared? What if I measure in three dimensions? Well now, I get a cube with two units on each side. Last time, I made a square, and called 2 to the power 2, 2 squared. This time, I've made a cube, so I'll call 2 to the power 3, 2 cubed. How many little cubes in my big cube? Pull it apart and count. I've got 8, the same answer as writing down 2 times 2 times 2. People don't usually refer to 2 to the power 4 as anything but 2 to the power 4. Can you guess why? Try to draw a diagram.